Before the sun sets on your 16th birthday, you will prick your finger on the spindle of a spinning wheel and fall asleep. The king's ordinance has been executed. There is not one spindle left in the kingdom. This is all that's left. Hey, Sammy, what are you up to? Oh, I found this box of yarn and I thought I should do something special about it. Okay, and what does Sleeping Beauty have to do with it? Don't you get it? The yarn, the spindle, the sleeping girl. To me, it's kind of obvious. <laughs> Instead of tangling good yarn, why don't we craft something better with it? Come on, follow me. Mm -hmm. Oh, hi guys. I didn't notice you were already here. Would you look at all these colorful, fluffy threads? You know, we don't often work with yarn in our videos. But you should know that there are a couple of them on our channel. Check them out if you haven't yet. Great. I'm sure they will, Sammy. <laughs> but now we need to get started with our craft. Cool. Sue, what's it going to be? A nice pink sweater or a long scarf? You know, Sammy, why don't you take this and start making that scarf? Yay! <laughs> Sorry, guys. I had to send him off because sometimes he gets much too involved. Actually, we won't be knitting today at all. I'm going to show you how to make a cute teddy bear from yarn. Give a thumbs up to this video and follow my lead. Okay, we've made 100 thread layers, and this should be enough. And now be careful with the scissors. Sue, I made a new scarf. What are you doing? Oh, the guys and I made a sort of hasp of yarn, and now we need to tie it up with one more thread. Right in the middle, like this. Uh-huh. I see. And what is it for? So that we can do this, and nothing falls apart. Guys, be careful with the scissors, and watch out for your fingers. Susie, what are you making anyway? A pom-pom? No, Sammy. This will be the body of a cute teddy bear. Or should I say, a part of it. Ah, that sounds really cool. I want to help. Well, of course. You can make a few more pom-poms just like this one. Uh-huh. And then we'll glue them together one by one to make our teddy bear rather big. Just one nice drop will be enough, guys. Try to be neat as well. Here we go. Perfect. Subscribe to our channel if you want to see the final result as badly as I do. Here's what we've got, guys. We glued two pom-poms together. To make this whole construction look more like a fluffy toy's body, we'll trim it a bit, this way. You definitely should be careful at this stage, or even better, ask an adult to help. Yeah, try to do that hairdo evenly and don't cut off too much. Oh, oh, what, what's happening? Just a yarn fall, Sammy. <laughs> Why don't we finish the craft first, Sammy? We still have a lot to do. Pom-poms for paws should be smaller, but the process is the same. Now we'll cut the excess thread. Tie up this piece really tight. We already did this earlier today. This way. And carefully cut it like this to make it more fluffy. The next step is trimming, right? Let a real master do that, Susan. Go ahead, Samuel Scissorhands. <laughs> All done! Great job, Sammy. I made one too. Now the legs of our teddy bear can go in their places. I thought you'd need this, Susie. A teddy bear should have four paws anyway. Gotcha. Thank you. But for the bear's arms, we'd better do this first. It'll help us adjust the shape a little bit. I see. The bear's arm should be long-ish. That's right. Now we'll use some magic. And voila. Here comes a glue drop. Whoop. This paw goes in its place. Right here. As well as the second one. It's all pretty simple. Er, it's time to make our bear's head. Stay tuned. Okay, we are already familiar with the next step. Let's take a yarn thread and start twisting it around the fingers. Wait up, Susie! I want to count how many laps you will make. <laughs> All right, then. Here we go. 
One and two, three, four, five, thirty-six, thirty-seven. Let's see. Sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four. Oh, I don't feel well. And eighty. Phew! No wonder Sam's exhausted. Oh, hey! I see sheep jumping around my head. Oh, poor thing. Seriously, Sammy, I think you had better take a rest for a little bit. In the meantime, I will continue. This time, we need to make knots on both sides of this piece using another thread. And oh, we're gonna need two of these pieces. I'm here with the glue gun. Move, Susie. No, no, Sammy, not yet. This time, we'll just tie them together. Let me show you. The threads of the upper piece come here. Guys, you should do this thoroughly. All right. And now the threads of the lower piece should tie the upper one. Don't forget to hide the threads properly. I really like that our craft today is so simple. Do you agree, Sue? And you guys, don't forget to subscribe then. This is what you should get in the end. To me, it looks like a yo-yo, only a fluffy one. <laughs> but before we proceed with this piece, we need to make three smaller hasps. Oh no, spare me! I can't stand any more twisting and rolling! Fine, I bet you guys already got the idea of how to make them anyway. Whoosh! Perfect. I guess that these two little pom-poms will be the ears of the bear. But why do we need the third one? Wait just a few seconds, Sherlock, and you'll see. Make sure you left some space for ears among all the threads. Oop. Here they are. Press the ears a little to glue them down tightly. Great. Drum roll. And the third little piece is the bear's mouth. What do you say, Sam? Almost awesome. Be right back. I wonder where he went. In the meantime, let's trim the bear's head a bit here and there to make it look neater and more bearish. Just be careful with sharp objects, guys. Watch your fingers. Hey, Susie, are you done yet? Hmm, I guess. Why? Close your eyes. Okay. Now look. Wow, where did you find these? In the nearest craft store. Amazing. Let's just add a bow and our cute teddy bear from yarn will be done. Check him out once more, guys. Oh, look at this cute little beastie. Adorable. Hi there, sweetie. Do you want to see what I've got for you? Yippee! I'm free from the spell! Woohoo! Sammy, I doubt that the real Aurora would have skipped and hopped like that. Well, that's because she didn't have a teddy bear from yarn like I do now. <laughs> that's true. Guys, did you like our craft today? Do you want to repeat it? Give us a thumbs up if your answer is yes, and subscribe to our channel if it's a definitely yes. And hit the bell button so you don't miss new awesome videos of Sue and Sam. Bye!